Welcome to BBTV Network, coming to you from the UK studios of BizVision. I'm your host, Malcolm Gallagher. Now, our criteria here at BTVTV is to be open-minded, to bring our audience any ideas, insights and innovations, provided they're legal and moral, that may be of value to them in their world of business. So with that in mind, today is a new dimension for me. My guest is certainly an innovator in wellness and healing. And what's appealed to me um, is that it's that wellness and healing. You see, there's been and continues to be so much stress, the cause of many diseases, that I think it's beholden that we explore what solutions may be around. So that's why I'm so delighted to be introducing you to a true health pioneer. He's the founder of Scalalite. Please meet Tom Palladino. Welcome, mm -hmm. Tom. A pleasure to be here. Thank you for the invitation, Malcolm. It's a delight to talk to you, Tom. And whereabouts in the wonderful world are you today? Uh, I'm calling in from Florida, the sunshine state of Florida, the United States. Is it sunshine? It is sunshine, yes. Yeah. Always. Always. Uh, always. And just don't don't think you've got the all of it, you know, because it's sunshine in here in England, northern England at the moment, you know. Uh, yeah, or maybe only for today, for the rest of the year, but it's still sunshining. Tom, I'm looking forward to hearing about your pioneering work. Now, viewers and listeners, I'll be talking to Tom in three parts. Now, first, I'll ask him, what is Scala Light and what can he do in layman's terms for us, especially those of us in business? In part two, I want him to imagine a busy business leader of, say, an IT company, stressed out, starting to get all types of sniffles and illnesses. How can mm -hmm. Scala Light help and how can we measure success? And in part three, I want to talk to him about sustaining the benefit that Scala Light brings. But Tom, before we get into that three-part talk, can you briefly introduce yourself to my viewers and listeners? Who is Tom Palladino and what prompted you to delve into the work that resulted in Scala Light? Uh, thank you again. I work with a, an energy dimension known as scalar light, what people would commonly call today a zero point energy. It's not electricity. And I've devoted my career to developing instruments and to be able to control that dimension, scalar energy, zero point energy. And it's incredible what you can achieve once you're in that dimension, so to speak, and you can control that energy with, with instrumentation. So that's been my career path. Um, I think it's time well spent, and I think what I have established really will serve to benefit the world eventually as this science is embraced. It's a new science. Fascinating, yeah. So, Tom, let's start a talk. What is, as you say, scalar light, and what can it do in layman's terms, please, for us, especially, as I say, those of us in business? Well, it, again, scalar light is a new science, and it is – as far as I'm concerned, it originates from the sun and the stars. So it's a cosmic primal force. Now, when I am working with people with this scalar technology, I work with them by way of a photograph. People will send us a photograph. And I actually place a photograph of a person or a pet inside the scalar energy instrument. Again, this is a new type of science. It's a new technology. And that type of energy will sometimes calm the person. Why? Because we can calm the brain waves, or we can uh, perhaps balance the meridians. People have seven meridians, seven chakras. Now, how would that help somebody in business or somebody who's stressed out at school? By calming them. This has a calming effect. This has the ability to impart a, a sense of tranquility because it's an energy, it's not electricity, it's an energy that will rebalance the brain waves and the meridians. Mm. In some ways, I was just thinking that, Tom, as you were explaining that to us, um, sadly, a, a few weeks ago, we had to have our dog put down after 14 mm. and a half years of my best pal. You know, mm. he really was uh, all over with me. And today, when I look at a picture of, of him, and I just sit there and I look at it, I get an energy. Uh, I get an energy remembering myself, the times that we did things together, the walks that we went through, the woods, the fields and, and everything that we have in here in beautiful Northumberland in Northeast England. And, and it's, is, that, is that somewhere towards it? That's identical. 
Malcolm, that's identical. A photograph carries the image or it carries an actual force field. And you can pick that up. You do that instinctively. I can do that. I can pick that up with an instrument. So what am I saying? Photographs capture a person's spirit. They capture mm -hmm. an animal's spirit, so to yeah. speak. Because everything, is, the expression is everything is energy. And that energy can be embedded, downloaded on a photograph. And it is fascinating, Tom, that, you know, because in certain countries, uh, the, the local people don't like you taking the, their pictures because they feel you're capturing their spirit. There's truth to that. And I can prove that now by way of scalar energy, which is the spirit. I'm working not with a stream of electrons, electricity. I'm working with a presence, as you said. And a scalar energy spirit is imparted on photographs. So those who have that particular cultural belief, there's merit to that. Brilliant, brilliant. It's really fascinating. Uh, Tom, before we move to part two, I'd like to remind viewers and listeners of your website address URL, which obviously viewers, you can see it on the screen behind me. But for listeners, let me spell it out. It's all the W's, all the W's. Scale of light now. That is S C S C A L A R S C A L A R light dot com scalarlight.com now if you add a little extra to that url you can get some free books on scalar energy to download so what you would do is you go to all the w's scalarlight.com forward slash scalar hyphen energy hyphen world.com i'll say that again for you all the w's scalarlight.com forward slash scalar spelled S-C-A-L-A-R hyphen energy hyphen world dot com. Tom, I want to give you a scenario of a likely client. Is this stressed out? Is the CEO of an IT business? And you know how IT has been so busy right. with it during the pandemic, people. He's starting to get all types of sniffles and illnesses. How can Scalar Light help? What's the process and how can he measure success? Sure, sure. We, what we offer on the website, we always offer 15 days of free sessions. Now, when I work with a person's photograph, not only can we balance their brain waves or chakras, we have found that the instrument can identify by way of a person's photograph, say a, a microbe or a pathogen, and we can erase, we can disassemble those pathogens. We do all of this by way of photographs. Now, keep in mind, this is non-physical energy, scalar energy, and we work with the force field on a photograph. Mm. But this is indeed a valid science. I will, I will note this, Malcolm. My predecessor achieved a U.S. and a British patent for this instrument. Oh. So there is scientific basis to this. Mm. Fascinating. So uh, that CEO then, um, uh, how long would you think that it would start to take effect you know, on scale of light. You're saying 15 days of, yes. of freeness there. Does, can something be achieved in 15 days? Yeah, very much so. I mean, usually within the first two to three days, people will feel it. And why do we offer 15 days? We want to give them the full gallon, so to speak. We want to give them the, the full scalar light session by way of their photograph. So yeah. we prove what we can do. And that's why we offer free sessions on the website. Mm. Uh, just being a doubting Thomas, t Tom, um, doubting Thomas, Tom, sorry. Um, but, you know, uh, is there anybody that Scalar Light can't work on, or won't work for? No. And the, why, the reason I say that, the energy is fundamental. And mm. it can, you, the energy can always work with a person's photograph and have a positive influence on their force field on the photograph. So on account of the fact that the energy is everywhere and it's fundamental in character, it will produce that, uh, that appropriate uh, effect, that desirable uh, effect. Mm, yeah. I, I must <clears throat> admit, when I first heard about, about uh, the brilliant work you're doing, Tom, I'm, I was puzzled in everything. And then I reflected back, as I said, to that picture of our dog, Harvey, you know, who uh, genuinely was my friend and uh, looked after my wife when I was away presenting and things like that. Um, and, I, you know, he's still there, the presence of him still there. So, Tom, uh, I want to move to part three. I'm guessing you've thought about clients. I want to say that uh, Scalar Light is not a quick one-time fix, um, or I could be wrong, so please correct me. 
But if I'm not, how does a client of yours go about sustaining the results and indeed building on them to achieve even greater benefit? You know, that, that's a good question, but that's really specific to the individual. So some people experience a, a marvelous uh, impact within the first 15 days, and that's all they need. After that, it's up to them to decide if they want to continue. Mm. So it's hard to say, but I will say that, again, this is a fundamental energy, and it will produce a favorable outcome for everybody. Why? Because that's the nature of this energy. And on account of the fact that I'm working with energy, nothing can stand in the way, so to speak, with, of energy. So this energy cannot be blocked. It's the energy of the cosmos. You cannot block it. So there is a desired effect. Mm, yeah, yeah. I, I'm just <clears throat> wanting to encourage everybody uh, who is uh, viewing or listening to uh, pop along to uh, Scale of Light. Uh, dot com and and find out more as you were saying there and download this there's free books for you there because uh, i'm sure all of us all of us have looked at a photograph at some time and suddenly there's a those memories have been come flooding in uh, but also a certain energy around those me memories you know uh, and i i just find this whole concept uh, that tom's talking about fascinating now i said at the beginning of this interview that we believe at vvtv it's big holding of us to bring you as wide a dimension as possible in thinking with the intention of helping you in both business and personal life i trust you feel we've achieved that today with this chat with the founder of scalarlight Tom Palladino. Thanks, Tom, for such an insightful interview. Thanks for your time, Malcolm. I enjoyed myself.